New information on a story CBS2 first brought you last night at 11. Dozens of people in West Orange, New Jersey, had to evacuate their homes on Monday, and they are now living in a hotel. It has been determined that their building is dangerous after a rock slide caused by Hurricane Ida. CBS2's Lisa Rosner has more now on a meeting happening right now between residents in the town and the landlord. People who live in this apartment complex on Northfield Avenue say Hurricane Ida September 1st sent a tree into one building, evacuating four families, and triggered a rock slide that totaled cars. But other than that, the 40 remaining units were told everything was fine. In fact, the landlord just painted new parking spaces. But six weeks after the storm, this past Monday, close to midnight, residents were told they had 15 to 30 minutes to get out, possibly forever. It's, it's very traumatic. We're living in limbo. And Charity Bracy and others are living out of hotel rooms. Turns out Friday, October 8th, engineering firm Langen informed the town the slope is not stable and there is a high risk of further failure, which would likely result in significant property damage and possible loss of life. We asked the mayor why it wasn't until three days later everyone was evacuated. I know it was a Friday night and I don't think our engineer kind of caught it right away. So as soon as he caught it, we started talking and spent the day mobilizing the different professionals in town. I think management did drop the ball. We called the landlord John Jakimowitz to ask why six weeks after Hurricane Ida, residents only learned of this now. But shortly after we asked, residents, um, are they going to be able to move everything out of their apartments? He only said, we have a plan and can't talk further because he has an attorney and hung up. We're not living here rent free. We pay to live here. And we need help. Some of us are disabled, some of us are elderly. There are some residents here that rely on oxygen tanks for survival. What's going to happen? We're told the landlord will be handing back security deposits at this meeting, but ultimately the building needs to be leveled. The mayor tells me he will work with residents to get all their belongings out before that happens. In West Orange, New Jersey, Lisa Rosner, CBS 2 News. And if you want to help the residents, you can donate to a nonprofit fund run by the mayor. We have a link at cbsnewyork.com.